let's start with a little background info. And for that, we're going to play Phosphorus Fun Facts, the exciting game of knowledge the whole family can experience. Here's your first question. Phosphorus, is it animal, vegetable, or mineral? The answer is mineral. Question two. In how many cells of your body can phosphorus be found? A few, some, a lot, every one of them. The answer is every one of them. 100%, that's right. If it's a cell in your body, it's got phosphorus in it. All right, now here's a tricky sounding question. If phosphorus is found in every one of your cells, how much of it is in your bones and teeth? 35%, 45%, 85%, 95.15372964533%. The answer is 85%. 85% of your body's phosphorus content is in your bones and teeth. Next question. Why is phosphorus an important mineral to your bones? A, it makes them strong. B, it helps protect them from breaking. Or C, it helps keep you walking, yeah, which is a good thing. The answer is all three. OK, here's the last question before we move on to our Bonus round. Do you know the number that represents your phosphorus level from your last blood test? This is very important. Do you know that magic phosphorus number? Around here, we refer to it as your personal phosphorus number. And the answer is... Ah, it was actually kind of a trick question. Now, if you know what that number is, you were supposed to shout it out when I said, and the answer is... Now, if you don't know what that number is from your last lab test, and if you don't know your personal phosphorus number, you ask your dietitian. Now, why is knowing your personal phosphorus number important? Because the optimal range for phosphorus, according to the national recommendations, is 3.5 to 5.5. Now, if your number falls into that range, perfect. If it doesn't, you'll need to work with your dietitian to get it there. Now, it's important to keep your number in that range, right? Because you'll be healthier and happier. All right, now, that wasn't really a quiz question. I just threw it in. Okay, so how you doing so far? Amazingly fun facts about phosphorus, aren't they? Are you ready for the bonus round question? Phosphorus plays a key role in the body's ability to break down and use protein for what three purposes? The answers are growth, maintenance, and repair of cells and tissues. Now, if you knew those answers, you need to apply for a job writing these quiz questions. <laughs> Bonus question number two. What three body functions does phosphorus help make happen? Now think, this is an important one. The answers are muscle contraction, regular heartbeats, and the free flow of nerve impulses. Now, if you knew the answers to those questions, you've seen this program before. Okay, here's the final super bonus round question. This is for all the points and the world championship. How does your body get the phosphorus it needs? From the interaction of sunlight with the skin? From the food we eat? Or from little creatures called fortons that sneak into your room while you sleep and stuff it into your nostrils? The answer is food. Though a nationwide poll of Americans between the ages of 12 and 47 recently found that the little creatures called fortons ran a very close second. So there you have it, folks. Your body needs phosphorus down to every single cell. Your bones need phosphorus to keep them strong and healthy. And you get phosphorus from the food you eat. Now, before we go into that process of how that works, let me give you a little extra info about phosphorus, right? You know, those crime scene investigation shows where they use that black light to detect organic material at the crime scene? You know what that black light reveals? The phosphorus in the organic cellular material, huh? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Brings a whole new meaning to healthy glow, huh? <laughs> 